Hi artists, so today I'm going to challenge you to paint in a way that you probably never have before. I posted some videos of some artists that have had to overcome physical disabilities and learn to paint using their mouths or their feet. Today I'm going to challenge you to do the same and see what it feels like and experience it. These artists have had to learn how to paint with their mouths and feet and get really good at it. And it's a lot more challenging than they make it look because they've been doing it and have perfected it. Um, so now is your turn to experience a new way of making art, okay? So we're gonna start out with our mouths, okay? So you'll probably want to clean your brush before you put your mouth on your brush. And I'm gonna move my camera so you can see what I'm doing. You can try to paint something that is an actual thing, like a animal or a person or a flower, or you can just play around, okay? I, I am gonna try to paint a flower just because I think that's probably one of the easiest things that I could do with my mouth. For the, since this is my first time painting with my mouth, okay? So you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna put your brush in your mouth. Be careful, okay? Never walk around or run around with a brush in your mouth. You, you have to do this seated. Ah, seated, <laughs> seated, whoa! Okay. Now, I'm not gonna paint an entire flower right now. Here's one I, I started a little bit ago, just for the sake of time, so you don't have to sit here and watch this demo video forever. But I do want you to challenge yourself to like use different colors, maybe even try to mix colors with your brush in your mouth um, while you're painting and just see what it feels like. And then we're gonna have a discussion about like how your neck felt. Um, what was going on in your mind? Like, what were you thinking while you were painting? And um, how challenging it was. And also, like, if you think that those artists in the video just make it look easy, when really, in reality, it's not easy. Okay, so the other thing I want you to do is I want you to paint with your feet. So it might be kind of hard to see but I already have a piece of paper taped to the floor. You will need to tape your piece of paper to the floor or else it's gonna be moving around while you're painting. So now I'm holding my brush with my feet, with my big toe and the next toe and my foot. So you can see this a little bit better, okay? So now, I think I'm gonna challenge myself to try to draw a face. It'll be interesting to see if I, if I think this is harder or easier than painting with my mouth. So far, I can tell you, I feel like I have a little less control with my foot than I do with my mouth. I can see two eyes. I can see a nose and a mouth. Okay. Mm. Maybe some hair. Hmm. Okay, I just discovered that it's actually easier for me to do like something kind of like pointillism or stippling. Just blotting the brush into little dots. That's not too hard. All right, now I have to paint an actual 
actual head. Ooh, that's not easy. Okay. Now, ooh. this is kind of a freeing process too because you don't put as much pressure on yourself when you're drawing or painting in a way that you've never done before. But when you're using your dominant hand, the hand that you usually use to write or draw, you put a lot more pressure on yourself because you have more experience with that hand drawing and writing and painting, okay? So it's interesting to see if you put as much pressure on yourself with this process or if you can let go a little bit more. And right now, I'm kind of having fun doing this, but I can imagine that if I did this, for hours on end, my leg would get pretty sore, okay? All right, I'll show you what it turned out like. And when you do it, I would like you to spend more time on it than I did. I didn't spend as much time because I'm doing a demo video and if I painted for a really long time during the demo video, you guys would probably lose interest. So here's my, my foot painting of my face. Well, not my face, someone's face. <laughs> okay, happy art making, guys.